So today, we're going to be testing the 380 Gold Dot. Uh, I don't have the box for you, but uh, it's 90 grains, 1,040 feet per second at the muzzle. That's out of a 3 and 3 quarter barrel. Today we'll be testing out of a 3 inch, it's actually 3 and a quarter, uh, Taurus TCP. So it, uh, by the math, it comes out to be about 216 foot-pounds. It's a gold dot. I mean, you guys know the deal with them. Uh, they're bonded, lead core, uh, tried and true, and old as blue, I guess. They were uh, made by Spear originally for law enforcement, and uh, typically they're a good go-to round. So let's get out of here and see what we get. We'll test at a distance of 15 feet through four layers of denim. 380 Auto Gold Dot. And here's your result. You saw the two shots. Uh, it looked like it veered the first time and uh, kind of went off on its own little way. But there it is. You can see the expansion there. Stopped in the third milk jug. I like to see that because a lot of 380s you see stop in a second. They're very under penetrative. I guess that's how you'd say that. <laughs> Um, let me see if I got my scale in here. Where did it go? Yeah, you guys just keep looking at the bullet. <laughs> well, I am not seeing my scale, but you can see the expansion there. Not dramatic, you know. Um, I'd say it did not double in size. You know, I guess this would be a better view. At one point it was pretty good size, but then it just kind of curled back around itself, petals all laying over into a perfect little mushroom. Uh, it expanded good through the four layers of denim, and it worked like it should. You know, most of the time gold dots aren't uh, explosively impressive, but they always work, so that's up to you. I actually like the fact that it got a little bit more penetration and still expanded reliably out of a micro. Sometimes that's harder to find. But there it is, your 380 gold dot.